try to understand what is a plus b whole square so let's begin with a let's imagine a rope of length a something like this you have a yellow rope of length a unit imagine another rope of length b unit now you have two ropes one is a unit the another is b unit try to tie them together or means try to add them so when you add them a and b when you put them side by side you will get a longer rope of length a plus b now you have a longer rope of a plus b unit try to create one more copy of this length and try to create something like this so you got a l shape or right angle system with two edges both the ropes are of the same length a plus b a plus b try to create one more copy and put it here try to one more take one more copy of it and put it here so you have created what something like this a square now you have got a square whose side is a plus b now what is the area of a square side into side so you can say the area of this square is going to be a plus b into a plus b which is a plus b whole square so okay a plus b whole square is not that latin and greek it means the area of this complete square now try to see that you have this s the end point of this yellow rope and the end point of this yellow rope try to attach them with a let's say a white white thread so what do you see a white thread so you have divided this whole big square into two rectangles now try to see this end and try to see this end also try to attach this so what you got you have broken the whole square into four quadrilaterals out of four you got two squares and two rectangles one a big square a small square a vertical rectangle and a horizontal rectangle now let's try to see the big square if you try to see the big square you have got a side a by a what will be the area of this big square that's going to be a square now let's try to see the smaller square you have got a smaller square with side b by b what will be the area of this smaller square that is going to be b square so area of big square is a square area of small square is b square now let's try to see the area of this vertical rectangle you have the breadth as b and the length as a what is the area of rectangle length into breadth so you can say this is a into b now let's try to see the area of the horizontal rectangle you see this is length a and this is breadth b what will be the area of this horizontal rectangle ab now you see this is a square this is ab this is b square this is ab so what you can say that okay a plus b whole square which is the length area of the square equals a square plus ab plus ab plus b square now you see ab plus ab both are same so if you add them up what you will get twice so you can say a plus b whole square equals a square plus 2ab plus b square so this is a plus b whole square it's making sense right so can you do the same drill for a minus b whole square go and do it